Okay, we're on tip 16 right now, and this is one of those times when you do get to talk to your inner child outside your session, and that is when you have a definable inner conflict. So, this is one of the trickier aspects of uh, self-parenting, uh, especially when you're beginning. If you experience an inner conflict, during the day, the best thing you can do is sit down, write it out, and work it, and figure it out, and resolve it with a win-win solution. Uh, this is not some minor little thing that's going on. This is a conversation that's in your brain, and I want to do this, no, I want to do that, no, we should do that, no, got to do that. An inner conflict is a conversation that you hear inside your mind that does not get resolved. You hear it over and over. If you've heard the same conversation inside your mind for three days in a row, that's an inner conflict. You need to get that out of your head, onto the paper, and resolve it as quickly as possible. So. Inner conflicts are a trick. They're, it takes 15 to 20 of these to work out before you really have a handle on what you're doing. For most people in the West, when they hear about this conversation in, the, in their mind and they finally write it down, what they, early people, what they're doing is what we call inner bashing. And that's when one side goes, you're a bad person, and then the other side goes, no, you're you the bad person, and the other side goes, no, it's your fault that this happened, and the other side goes, no, you're the one that did everything. So it's basically an inner bashing where one side, and they're just arguing for no reason, and they're not saying anything. So this is uh, something that you need, if, if it is happening, write it out. But when you write it out, and you look to figure out the eight steps, you won't find anything that resembles a need. You'll just be hearing insults back and forth. So for that, I want to, uh, you know, just let you know that that's going to happen. But a genuine inner conflict, this is, this is bad. you got to figure it out. you got to work it out. And an inner conflict means that you have needs that are not being met by one or both selves, usually in conflict. And a good example is on Wednesday night, you're supposed to go to a meeting with, uh, that's for work. But also on Wednesday night, you have tickets to go to a play that you've been wanting to go to for months. So you can't do both at the same time. That's the key to the inner conflict. You cannot do both things at the same time. In my book, I talk about skiing. Uh, you can't go skiing and you can't attend a seminar at the same time. So you have to resolve that. Inner conflicts are tricky. Uh, you can resolve them quite easily when you go through the eight steps. I'm going to do a program on the eight steps, obviously. Uh, so uh, look for that if you have any questions on inner conflicts. There's a form on the, on the website that uh, has you work it out. I believe I made a Chinese version of it, which you, I can send you if you email me. So just know that you need to do 15 to 20 inner conflicts before you get it right. And then once you get it right, you'll have it. And then you will not have very many inner conflicts because as soon as you have one, you'll resolve it. And it'll be quick, it'll be easy and everybody will be happy because the whole idea is it's a win-win. Your inner child gets to win and your inner parent gets to win. It may not seem possible in the beginning when you first try some of these, but as you get practice and, and do it, you'll see it's, it's always possible to work out a win-win solution between the two inner voices inside your mind. So. I encourage you to start working on inner conflicts as soon as you hear them. Any conversation that's going on inside your brain that sounds exactly the same and it's been there for three days, that's it. That's enough. So write that down and work out the eight steps.
All right, and, and enjoy that process. It's 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 actually a fantastic process.